Dear students, I welcome you all to this problem solution series in digital electronics. I am solving the problems from the book Digital Design by Maurice Mano and Michael Cilletti. So in this video, I am solving the problem number 3.17 from the chapter number 3. So the problem is draw a NAND logic diagram. That means we have to draw a logic diagram that will use only the NAND gates. Okay, that, that implements the complement of the following function. That means we are given with a function here. This is the sum of min terms expression. Okay, and from this we have to find out the complement. First of all, we have to find out the complement of this function. Then we have to draw the logic diagram using NAND gates. So we can see that we have four variables here. We have to draw a four variable map. Okay, so in a four variable map, we will have four rows and four columns. Okay. So I will draw it. So this is the procedure 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0. So this side also 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0. So this is nothing but a gray mapping. So we have A, B, C, D. Then we have to put this sum of min terms value 0, 1, 2. Oh, sorry. This one will be 1, 0, 1, 2, 3. Okay, then we have 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, then 12, 13, 14, 15. So the, all the other boxes will have 0 values. Okay, these all are 0. So in the question what we are given, we are given that we have to implement the complement of the, this function this given function we have to find out the complement we have to use the complement to make the logic diagram so what we have to do complement means we have to consider here the zero values okay so from this table what we will do we will find we will take the zeros and from that we will find out the logic diagram for the function f so these are the zero values here so let us write down this one this is a this one is b okay this is c and this one is d so from these zeros we can combine like this this will be one term this will be second term and this one will be the third term so the next point is to keep in mind that we are considering here zeros so we have to write the expression or the sum of product expression or sum of min terms expression that will have the complement of this function of this one function so f complement so you have to write f complement because we are considering here zero values okay so from this term what we'll get we'll get b and d bd plus from this term what we'll get we'll get b C plus from this term what we'll get we'll get a c a c then we have to find out the function f so we have to remove this complement okay so what we have to do here we have to again take the complement to get this f function to get the normal function okay so what we'll do b d plus b c plus a c okay whole complement then we will use De Morgan's theorem and we will get BD whole bar into BC whole bar into AC whole bar. Now what we have to do, we need a whole complement function. So for getting the whole complement function, what we will do, we can take two times complement. Okay, one complement and another complement. So this will be a NAND gate. Now because we have to after after getting these three parts we are we have to use another NAND gate to get this complete function and we have to another use another NAND gate now let us draw these input lines we have a b c d a b c and d, d. so we have these lines so in the first term we have b d whole bar b okay d multiplication then complement this is nand gate okay b d whole bar here we we'll get b d whole bar okay then we have b c whole bar 
B C NAND gate and we'll get here B C whole bar or whole complement. Okay, then we have A C whole complement. A C use NAND gate and we'll get here A C whole complement. Okay, now we have to multiply this function and we have a complement so we can use here another NAND gate. Okay, so in the question we are given that draw the logic diagram that implements the complement of the function. That means we have to draw the logic diagram for f complement itself. Okay, we need not to find out this one. So what we have to do f complement we will write here and we will take this complement. Okay, then we need not to do again this complement. Okay, so only this part bd whole bar bc whole bar a C whole bar and whole complement. Okay, so now this problem becomes simple. So this is nothing but F complement. Okay, so after taking these values as input to this gate, NAND gate, we'll get here F complement. Okay, so thank you for watching. If you have any question, please put it in the comment section below. Also, like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.